Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Danny Riggs, and you're on ResTube. And today on ResTube, we have quite a bit of unboxing to do. And we will be opening stuff today by Clan Gallery, by Newberry Comics, and by Cherry Red Records. We're going to start with the stuff from Clan Gallery first because I've been looking forward to it the most. And so I'll see you over at the fireplace. The Wonder of Weird Tour was the second part of the Residence Randy, Chuck, and Bob trilogy of live tours, following 2010's Talking Light Tour. The Wonder of Weird focuses on the theme of sex, with its lead character Randy further detailing the story of his life now ruined by a sex addiction. Like Talking Light before it, The Wonder of Weird featured a stripped-down trio lineup of Randy Rose on vocals, Charles Bobick on keyboards and electronics, and Lionel Bob on guitar. The group wears variations of the same masks previously featured in Talking Light with the addition of Santa outfits and classic residence t-shirts. Despite the Christmas theme and the costumes and set designs, the show began at the end of January and ended in May. A running gag in the show is that despite being subtitled the 40th anniversary tour, it actually ended up taking place on the group's 41st anniversary. Before the band took to the road, demo versions of the songs were recorded, first in stripped down version, later with added vocals and guitar. Many of the songs made it into the final show, some didn't. We are happy to present the minimalist electronic versions for the first time ever on a two CD set. And the second double CD of Wonder of Weird demo versions has also already been announced by Clan Gallery. So that's definitely something to look forward to. So now that we know what we're actually opening, let's get into the Clan Gallery box. I've really been looking forward to this one because you might have seen in a former clip that this is basically from the era that really got me into the group, which is also why I'm wearing this shirt. And there it is. This is the first of two sets of demos of the Wonder of Weird tour, which was, as already stated, part two of the Randy, Chuck, and Bob trilogy. This has a total of 23 tracks on it. Mm -hmm. with that very cool Wonder of Weird logo down here. I'll carefully open this. And there it is again with Randy, Chuck, and Bob on the cover. And opening it up, we can see the whole Christmas motif. That was a part of the Wonder of Weird tour. Really looking forward to hearing this, so it will go right on my laptop and right on my MP3 player. That way I can listen to it as soon as possible. So, let's get into the next package. This Newberry Comics box has two LPs in it, which I've also been looking forward to. So let's go. A wicked good time. And here is the first of the two LPs being a duck stab on what they called fire orange with black streaks. This, as is the other record, is limited to 500 copies. And as you can probably see, this is really sealed, as in this sticker is on the outer shrink wrap. As is also the case with the Eskimo limited edition, which is clear with heavy black swirl. Now those are sealed, as was the copy of Meet the Residents that I got that is transparent blue with black swirl. Seeing that these are sealed and I do not intend on opening them, we will just have to take a look at the pictures that Newberry Comics as posted on their website. Mm -hmm. 
all three of these, even the Meet the Residents, are still available. And so if you're interested, I definitely suggest that you check that out. And I've read a lot of comments online of people saying that they don't leave the shrink wrap on. They're afraid of it bending the corners, etc. I know collectors that have been in this game for decades that have things that have been shrink wrapped since the 70s. And so I'm not particularly worried about that really. But if I do ever notice that these corners start to bend thanks to the shrink wrap, I guess I would have to open them eventually. And last, but certainly not least, we have the box here from Cherry Red Records. I wasn't really planning on buying these, but when I pre-ordered Wormwood, these were on sale, so I couldn't help myself. In here are two compilations, one entitled Musik, Music and Musik, which if I'm not mistaken is German, English and French. With the tagline 1980, The Dawn of Synth Pop, this is a three CD collection with a total of 57 tracks. And if you're looking for the residence track on it, it would be the last one, number 18 on CD2, and it is Discomo. Discomo, Discomo. It's based on Eskimo. It's gotta be Discomo. So let's take a look at the other compilation that's in this box. And that is Additive Noise Function. Close to the Noise Floor presents Additive Noise Function, Formative UK, European, and North American Electronica, 1978 to 1984. Excursions in Proto Synth Pop, Do It Yourself Techno, and Futurist Exploration. This is a 3 LP set, and as with the compilation we just looked at on CD, this also features only one track by the residents which is on side six, being side B of the third LP, and it is 99 Space Music that Cherry Red has already released on a CD compilation that I already have. I'd like to give a big thank you and shout out to the people at Clan Gallery, at Newberry Comics, and at Cherry Red Records, and also to all of you who tuned in to this episode of ResTube. A big thank you also, uh, ResTube has over 300 subscribers now, and I am really, really happy about that. So thanks to all of you. If you haven't subscribed yet, feel free to do so. You can hit the like button, you can share this clip online, that all helps a great deal. And so until we see each other again, you guys stay healthy and stay weird. Bye-bye, guys. Dawn of Synth Pop, these 3D, these 3D, 3D, 3D CDs. And thanks to all of you, that was kind of slurred. And also to all of you that tuned into this rep, rep episode of S-Tube.